Razza consider the statement if Oscar eats Chinese food, then he drinks milk. If the implication is in the form of if P then Q, P is Oscar eats Chinese food, and Q is Oscar drinks milk. For number one, we're asked to write the converse of the statement, and number two, we're asked to write the contrapositive of the statement. The converse of the implication if P then Q is if Q then P. Notice we interchange or swap the conclusion and hypothesis, or Q and P. And the contrapositive of if P then Q is if not Q, then not P. The contrapositive is the negation or negative of the conclusion implies the negative or negation of the hypothesis. So in this case, if the given implication is if Oscar eats Chinese food, then he drinks milk, the converse is if Oscar drinks milk, he eats Chinese food. And the contrapositive of the statement is if Oscar does not drink milk, then he does not eat Chinese food. And then number three, is it possible for the contrapositive to be false? If it were, what would it tell you? An implication and its contrapositive are logically equivalent, meaning either both are true or both are false, which means in order for the contrapositive to be false, the implication must also be false. So again, the contrapositive has the same truth value of the original implication. If the original implication is false, then the contrapositive would also be false. Number four, suppose the original statement is true, that Oscar drinks milk. Can you conclude anything about his eating Chinese food? Knowing Oscar drinks milk does not give additional information. Knowing if P then Q and Q are both true does not indicate the converse of if Q then P is true. If Q then P can be true or false, it's still unknown. And then finally number five, suppose the original statement is true and that Oscar does not drink milk. Can you conclude anything? In this case, we can conclude that Oscar does not eat Chinese food. If P then Q is true, then the contrapositive is also true, where the contrapositive is if not Q then not P is also true. And if not Q then not P is if Oscar doesn't drink milk, then he doesn't eat Chinese food. We can conclude Oscar does not eat Chinese food. I hope you found this helpful.